Hey what's up guys welcome to fine gap youtube channel and in today's video i'm going to show you how you can create custom buttons in android studio so let's start and please before start subscribe to fine gap youtube channel to stay up to date with latest program programming videos first of all i'm going to drag a button in my screen constraint right constraint left constraint top click on this split button you will see the coding of your button here and uh, margin top 20 dp width would be 100 dp and uh, height would be 50 dp i just define the height and width of my button now we have to create background of this button click on this drivable right click new drivable resource file uh, i'm going to name this btn underscore background press ok click on uh, uh, change this selector to shape add one more attribute uh, call android colon shape is equal to rectangle and uh, we have to add one another tag called solid space android colon color is equal to you can give a uh, like color purple 200 this is the by default color that android gives me let me zoom out this one and again go to your activity underscore main click on this button and type here android colon background add the rate of drivable and you can see that android studio is suggesting me btn underscore background just double click on this so you can see that the background of your button have been changed successfully so guys suppose you want to create a custom button with rounded corners how you will do it let me show you so guys let's just create our rounded corner button uh, first of all i'm going to improve its margin top from 20 to 50 dp again click on this design drag an other button and constraint it right constraint it left uh, constraint it to the bottom of button first now i'm give it going to give margin top 30 dp and uh, width would be 150 dp this button width would be 150 dp and uh, height would be 50 dp now again uh, right click on this drivable create new drivable resource file I'm going to name this file btn underscore background underscore one press ok uh, first of all just copy the whole co code of btn underscore background to btn underscore background one uh, because we just have to change we just have to do a little bit change in our this file you have to type a tag called corners and uh, android colon radius is equal to 10 dp that's it and now again go to your activity underscore main and uh, type here android background add the rate of drivable and you can see that android studio again suggesting me, me uh, my btn underscore uh, background one file just double click on it so guys you can see that let me just zoom in my this second button that i have created is its corner are rounded suppose if you want to increase uh, its corner radius you just have to uh, you can type here from 10 to 15 dp okay you can see that now corner are cor button corners are more rounded so guys let's just uh, move to another example suppose you want to create a custom gradient button in your android studio let me show you how you will achieve that so guys now you have to create a drag and drop another button and uh, constraint top constraint right constraint left click on the split button and uh, give margin top 30 dp height would be 50 dp and width would be 150 dp again we have to create a new drivable file click on new drivable resource file i'm going to name this btn background underscore 2 press ok button again we have to just copy the, the code of uh, btn underscore background underscore 1 and paste it to this file and now we have to change remove this uh, tag solid because we we want to create the background of our button uh, gradient so type gradient give it a start color suppose purple 200 and uh, android you have to give another property called android and color i'm going to change this end color to dark purple okay and you have to give another property called android type is equal to linear that's it now again open your 
btn uh, activity underscore main file and uh, again you have to do the same thing android colon background is equal to uh, btn background 2 so guys you can see that we are we have successfully create our android gradient uh, button so now guys suppose if you want to create a button with the a dark purple outline how you will achieve that so let me show you guys again you have to first of all let me create the our fourth button drag this constraint right constraint left constraint it uh, to the bottom of button third and uh, I'm going to give it margin top would be 30 dp width would be 150 dp height would be 50 dp now we have to again click on this drivable right click new drivable resource file btn underscore background underscore 4 press ok button ok guys again we have to just uh, copy this code to our btn underscore background underscore 4 dot xml file paste it here and uh, remove this gradient and now you have to type the tag stroke android color would be purple 200 or let me just give it a dark purple color and one more property is uh, android colon width would be 1 dp forward slash go to your active underscore main file and uh, android colon background uh, btn underscore background ok guys you can see that uh, here is our outline button in android studio so guys i hope that you will must like this video and if you have any question related to this tutorial you can ask us in the comment section we will try to answer your question and please, I again request you to subscribe our channel to stay up to date with latest programming videos. Thanks for watching.